Shalom everyone, this is Amir Tsalfati, and these are breaking news, and uh, believe it or not, something really big happened in Europe right now, and if you're not on Telegram, you probably don't even know what I'm talking about, so I'm going to wait for a few seconds, so you will uh, all um, connect, and let me update you on probably the most um the most uh, uh serious things since the beginning of the war in ukraine so again folks uh, shalom everyone this is amir Tsalfati. these are breaking news two rockets that the russians uh launched fell and landed in poland the Polish government is right now in a, an emergency meeting. The Polish uh, president called for an emergency meeting of the security cabinet. The war is expanding and that might cause the Polish military to enter into the Ukraine. We're not sure. Poland has a border with Ukraine, but again, today was one of the most massive missile strikes on Ukraine, all across Ukraine, over 100 cruise missiles hit Ukrainian facilities, critical uh, infrastructures. Kiev is in darkness right now. It's all dark. I, I have photos, I have videos. If, it, if it's not for the lights from the cars, it's completely dark. Um, millions of Ukrainians are right now with no electricity but again, breaking news, two rockets just landed within Poland. For the first time since the beginning of the war, Poland is now also being targeted by Russia. The Polish president just gathered and summoned a, a, a cabinet and uh, is uh, going to look into that. Uh, these are big news, huge news. I, I don't know if you understand how big it is. If you ever look at the map, you understand that Poland has a big border with Ukraine. And the main lifeline of Ukraine is from, uh, uh, from Poland to Krakow. And um, we are now talking about Russian cruise missiles that hit Polish territory and now basically caused Poland to be to be part of this war. Ladies and gentlemen, big news again today since the mid morning hours. I've been reporting on Telegram. I've got videos, I've got photos non-stop rockets at the, these are cruise missiles. They fly very low. And you can see them like an airplane flying low. And, and uh, ladies and gentlemen, over 100 cruise missiles hit probably the top 15 cities of Ukraine. If you're wondering why, what happened, this must be the revenge of Putin to the fact that the situation on the ground in the southern part um, is very desperate and he had to clear and evacuate his forces from the city of Kherson um, and move all of his troops to the eastern banks of the Dnieper River and basically start entrenching its soldiers there, his soldiers there. Big blow to the Russian military a few days ago when they had to clear one of their flagship cities that they conquered, Kherson, and on the banks of on the western banks of the Dnieper River down south. In, uh, Putin had to uh, evacuate the soldiers. But again, remember, the if you watch what I write, if you read what I write, watch what I say, the new general that Putin appointed is all about exhausting the civilians. He said, why should I waste all the lives of my soldiers when I can actually win the war through other means, such as strangling, choking, the locals with with so much difficulties and the winter in ukraine is brutal ladies and gentlemen breaking news breaking news push 
press the share button right now. People don't know that. Two Russian rockets just landed in Poland. The Polish president just summoned an emergency meeting of the government. I will keep you posted on Telegram. Again, if you're not on Telegram, you're missing out all the things that are happening. Okay, you know, information, videos, and photos. So please go to Telegram, find my, my channel, Amir Tsarfati, with 319,000 subscribers, and join so you can get firsthand information. I will keep updating you. But again, big, big, big news. Two Russian rockets landed in Poland. The Polish government right now is in emergency meeting. They might even decide to mobilize forces into Ukraine, which will mean that they will be in a direct confrontation with Russia. Russia is testing the water if NATO is going to do something because Poland is a NATO member and Russia is also testing the water um, if um, um, not only there will be a response, but also Russia wants to send a message to the countries around Ukraine to stop assisting Ukraine and stop using your ground to deliver all the weapons that NATO is sending to the Ukrainian military. Big news, two Russian rockets just landed in Poland and now Poland is within this whole cycle of war. Press share button, share this news. I will keep you updated on Telegram. Go to Telegram, get my channel, Amir Tsarfati, 319,000 subscribers. I'm, the reason I'm telling you, I'm not bragging, because all the other Amir Tsarfati, there are fake channels. And I don't know what they're saying there. It's not me. They might even be asking for money or telling you about some orphanage that they want you to support. This is not me. But listen, the only uh, Telegram channel that is mine is having 319,000 subscribers. When you see that, you know this is the right one. Follow me there. Again, two rockets just landed. I'm talking about Russian rockets, cruise missiles, um, landed within Poland. Poland got hit by Russian rockets right now. Uh, I mean, it happened about... Uh, you know, within the last hour, and, and now the Polish government is an emergency meeting. Big news, big news. Today, Ukraine had one of the worst days since the uh, beginning of the war. More than 100 cruise missiles hit over 15 major cities. Kiev was targeted. In fact, on my Telegram channel, I, I, I show you the, the video of the cruise missile that is hitting a a power station in Kiev, and therefore Kiev is right now, Kiev is right now in, in darkness. It's very, very sad. Uh, over four and a half million Ukrainians don't have electricity. This is amazing, folks. So again, share this with as many as you can. Breaking news, I will keep updating you about what is going on in the war um, on Telegram, okay? Thank you. God bless.